default cube, and I'm just gonna go ahead and say it's a 50% so it doesn't take forever and waste your time, and render an image. What you're gonna have by default is a solid background, which you might not want. Maybe you want a transparent background. No problem. Now all we have to do to get that is go to the scene, go to cycles, go to film, Click transparent, render once again, render the scene, and you're gonna have a transparent background as it can be a PNG. You can simply do image, save as a PNG file, open in Photoshop, do whatever you want with it. Part B, as I promised, if you wanna have an animation and you want a background transparent for your animation, not a problem. You could render it uh, this way, just render your animation as PNG files, but then you got to put them all back together again, and that's kind of a pain. So how to get around that? Click FMMPEG video. For encoding, you can put QuickTime, and then for the video codec, just put QTRLE, QT animation, and render it that way. Click render animation, and there's no need to waste your time with the whole thing because I guarantee this has a transparent background for the animation. One note is that um, this may not open uh, on your file system. You might actually have some trouble opening it. Uh, my Mine just doesn't play it in my QuickTime viewer. So um, you can open it in Premiere. I use W Premiere, but other video editing programs can probably work because you're probably going to want to composite it with some other file too instead of having just an invisible background. Uh, anyway, hope that helps.